Welcome to Tonight with Cassidy. Last night, I started the show telling you a breaking news story that I somehow found myself in the middle of. Helping the volcano rescue team find one of my good friends who had gone missing on Mount St. Helens. Now tonight, luckily, Mike and Amanda are home safe, they're relaxing, and deserve all of the food and drinks in the world after a very, very stressful experience. Now they definitely, in my opinion, deserve a very large chocolate cake and that is perfect timing because in a random turn of events that I'm not sure how I feel about, I am competing in the Oregon Historical Society's Celebrity Chocolate Cake Smackdown on Monday. None of these cakes were made by me. This is from a previous year of the Smackdown. People, I mean, they bring their A-game baking these chocolate cakes. This is actually just peaking my anxiety right now because those look like beautiful cakes and like nothing I've ever made. So as you probably guessed, um, I'm not an amazing baker. I've not made very many chocolate cakes in my lifetime. So that means I need your help. So as usual, I posted the event in our Facebook group, Kicking It With Cassidy, which you should join if you haven't because not only can you chime in with pictures of your cat, like yesterday. Now, I asked for your baking tips, your recipe suggestion, and this was just a couple of hours ago, but you guys have totally come through already. So here's what you said so far. Dylan said use a chocolate beer in the batter. It makes it moist, and depending on the beer, it's a little more depth, and then, even suggested the Rogue Ales Double Chocolate Stout. I might have to try this, plus if I get stressed out while I'm baking, I can have a couple sips, right? Oh, and mix it with a hazelnut porter for a Snickers beer, what? Oh my gosh, sounds more like a, like a Nutella cake, right? Oh, Roxanne put the recipe for a ch triple chocolate bunt cake. I appreciate just putting the whole recipe there because then I just can follow that. Don't need to do any Googling as myself. Oh, Megan says, here's the best chocolate sheet cake ever. Robin says sneak over to a piece of cake and sell one and get a double fudge ganache cake. That's like what Maggie said, just use someone else's cake. I'm not trying to start a, a celebrity chocolate cake smackdown controversy, guys. I don't wanna be part of a scandal. And then Ryan, last but not least, a chocolate peanut butter fun cake recipe. If the, if the cake says fun in the title, it probably is something that I would love to do. So again, this is in the Kicking It With Cassidy Facebook group. I need more tips and I don't have to bake the cake until Sunday night because the competition is on Monday. So go leave a comment. You have like a day or two to think about it. Sunday night, I'll be baking and shooting some video of it. And of course we will have video of my embarrassing loss in the cake competition.